It is a major eyesore around San Diego. Shopping carts stolen and then abandoned around town. New at 7 o'clock, 10 News anchor Itika Milana shows us how the cost of these carts is eventually passed along to you. These colorful vessels can be a lifesaver during runs to Target or the grocery store. But some people are taking advantage of them by hauling them off the store's property and then abandoning them wherever they please. It's the lazy person <laughs> that takes the cart from here and maybe lives up the street a ways and then they just throw it on the ground someplace and leave it. The problem is rampant around San Diego. Take a look at this. Nine carts perfectly lined up on Mission Center Road and Hazard Center in Mission Valley. Oh, well, it looks like nobody cares. Several were filled with trash, all but one from Target, which is several blocks away. This one is from PetSmart, which is several miles away. It doesn't look good at all. They serve as living quarters for a lot of people. He's right. We also saw this one being used by a homeless person. They do get left out in our community. San Diego City spokesman Bill Harris. If they're blocking the right of way, if they're in the way of a sidewalk or out in the street, our environmental services department will come out and pick those up. City crews will either recycle them or return them to the stores they belong to. And they're not cheap, each one costing up to several hundred dollars. Some stores hire cart wrangling services to round them up around town. Costs which are passed along to you and me. Itika Milanis, 10 News.